Hey, 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 what is going on, everybody? You know what I'm about to say. I still haven't found the shirt yet, but guess what? I'm looking for it. Because you know what today is? Hope day. Yeah. <laughs> Happy Wednesday, everybody. I hope you guys are having a productive week this week. Today, I want to uh, touch on the subject on self-doubt as we are approaching. I don't forgot the days. Don't quote me on this one. But we are still approaching this mental fitness boot camp. How things you need to get rid of in 2021. So I'm going to touch on the subject of self-doubt today. Dante Kearney here with DK Business and Mindset, where I help hopeful entrepreneurs who lack direction, who lack direction by showing them business strategies. Now, how do I do that? I do individual coaching, I do workshops, and I also establish a roadmap to success. Now, guys, if you like what you see, make sure you hit that like button. Also comment in the comment box self-doubt because we are getting rid of that in 2021 remember come on let's let's do it hold on to it and yeah, get the thing out of the park so yes we are getting rid of self-doubt in 2021 so let's dive on into it so self-doubt man self-doubt is something that i suffer still suffer with to this day but you know what we all do it so we're all going to get through this together i'm going to talk about it and you can use this video as a reference to you and how you need to get rid of self-doubt on a daily basis so you can hit your goals for 2021. So your belief system determines your actions. Absolutely, 100%, yes it does. Your belief system will determine your actions on a daily basis. So if you have been growing up believing that you can't do this, you can't do that. You can't do whatever else someone told you. That's your belief system. That is your whole belief system. That is what you believe in your and you have very limiting beliefs. And a lot of that self-doubt will crush any beliefs that you have of going forward. So I know coming from a small small uh, like a small area in Cumberland County, New Jersey, you know, a lot of people in that area has never really made it too big. Like there was nobody in our area that we can honestly say that was like huge, you know, you know, it wasn't until like 2010, 2011, that Cumberland County even saw anybody come out of there and make it big. Like uh, Mike, Mike Trout comes from Millville, New Jersey, and we're and I'm from that area. So you know, when people saw Mike Trout, they're like, oh, my God, we have someone of that caliber coming out of Cumberland County. But it, it, but people have such a small mind. And, and it's just my opinion. Don't quote me on this. But people in my mind, in my mind from Cumberland County, New Jersey, have a very small mindset. So it's like it, it's hard to expand yourself and push yourself forward when there's so many people who are putting their self-limiting beliefs on you and putting their self-doubts on you because there's people who have tried to come out of Cumberland County, New Jersey and, and end up finding themselves back there. So, hence why I'm not there, <laughs> I'm in Florida. So, you know, it, being in Florida has allowed me to expand my mind. It has ex allowed me to expand my thinking, my creativity, uh, things that I've said that I am going to do, I'm gonna bring to life because it, I don't surround myself with those type of people anymore who has those self-limiting beliefs and self-doubts. So, you know, it just, you know, self-doubt really prevents you from not what, what we talked about the other day. We talked about, you know, the fear of failure, right? So that fear of failure and that self-doubt prevents you from even experiencing anything that you need to experience. So you become better at it or even trying to do it because you have that hopeless mentality of, uh, I might as well not even try it because I, I believe I can't do it because someone else told you. That's why. So self-doubt can be very, 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 very bad. It can be a serious, serious roadblock on, on, on your success. So you need to trust in your gut. See this good I got here? I trust in it. And I trust in it well. <laughs> if I can. My gut tells me that I'm going to be somebody someday. Dante Kearney will be a known name 
somewheres. A big meal means somewheres. Someone's going to know who I am and say, man, this guy has inspired me. This guy has motivated me. He has pushed me to become as successful. Someone, someone's going to know my name. And I firmly, firmly believe that. And maybe I don't have the whole belief now. I don't, maybe I don't have the 100% confidence that that's going to be the case. But guess what? I'm going to faith it till I make it, baby. Not fake it till you make it. Faith it till you make it. See, fake it when you make it. It's, it, it's, you can only fake it for so long, man. You can only fake it for so long. When you faith it till you make it, you come, you come at it with a generosity. You come at it with a humble mentality of, I may not be where I want to be yet, but I'm getting there. So I want to act like I want to get there. I want to act like I'm there. So that way it'll it'll push me to do the things to get there. Because you got to think of like you have to put yourself in that mentality of the where where do you want to be in life? And what would that person be doing if that person was already there? So now you put yourself in that mind frame. OK, this person would be doing this if he, that person was already there. So now you start doing the things that person is uh, you're, you start to do the things of the person that, uh, of, of the person that you want to be. If you want to be a leader, you start doing what leaders do. If you want to be a, a, a motivational speaker or or uh, whatever you want to be, you start doing what that person is doing. And, it, and once you start doing what that person is doing, it elevates you to get to that point. So. No more self-living beliefs in 2021. We're again rid of that. All right. <laughs> so if you like what you saw, make sure you hit that like and comment button. And also, guys, share my stuff. You know you love you. You know you wanna share it to somebody who needs it. I'm not asking you to share it just to share it. Just share it to somebody who needs it. Who needs that little oomph? Who needs that little inspiration for the day? I'm not here for millions and millions of people. I'm here for that one person who gets my message. That's all I'm here for. All right. So I'll be back with more content with you guys tomorrow.